Allow me to present LearnCube's AI Teacher Assistant, a tool which enables you to create personal exercises for your students tailored to their particular needs. So, you know what your student needs, but you don't have any materials focusing on just that. Creating your own takes too much time and finding a pre-made exercise that's the right fit can be just as frustrating. We've all been there. But now, with LearnCube's AI Teacher Assistant, we have a great solution. This is such a versatile tool and it's improving all the time. So I'm going to create some more videos focusing on all the different aspects of your teacher assistant. But for now, let me give you a quick overview. The AI assistant can be found inside the classroom here on the right hand side. To get started, I need to select the level, language and exercise type. At the moment, there are seven different options which can be used for a broad range of needs. Next. I need to feed my assistant some target vocabulary. I can click here to enter a list of terms like cat, dog, mouse, or a general topic like animal names. Alternatively, I can use the Smart Highlighter tool. Use this tool to select words from your lesson materials or annotations. I can just click here, here, and here to really quickly grab the words that my student has made mistakes with. If you want a whole phrase, you can highlight more than one word at a time. I can also give my assistant some notes about what I want. For example, what's the grammar topic I'm focusing on? Do I want two easy questions and two difficult ones? I could also tell it about my student. With our animal names exercise, I'll get a very different result if my student is a child or a veterinary nurse, for example. When you're ready to go, click Ask Assistant. I'll now see a preview of my exercise. If I want to make any small changes, I can edit the content. And when I'm happy, I can click Add to Whiteboard. The exercise is now added to my virtual classroom, and what's more, it's automatically stored in my library so I can access it again in the future. I am really excited to see all the different ways in which you use this tool. Have fun experimenting, and as always, happy teaching.